we state, people of the state, should have to lose resources that there's just no reason to lose. Zach what Smith calls that? it a tragedy. You are not supposed to go and dredge up the middle of a stream. You're also not supposed to uh, affect the historic, scenic, and aesthetic beauty of the state. Smith is talking about what he calls the devastation of Bayou Sara by sand and gravel mining. The stream has been uh, pretty much rendered unfit or partially unfit for the fish that are trying to live there. Smith and other residents who live near the pits have also long complained that the trucks which haul the sand and gravel are tearing up their country road and posing a danger by speeding. With the help of a radar gun, we wanted to see how fast the trucks were going. But it wasn't long before word got out that we were here. When Smith and other residents took their concerns to state and parish governmental officials, they found themselves the target of a lawsuit by the Feliciana Sand and Gravel Company. Feliciana Sand and Gravel claims the residents' complaints have cost them business. But residents say the lawsuit violates their right of free I mean, speech. If, if we lose at this case right here, it's, it's going to hurt a lot of people. Uh, uh, you won't be able to speak out hardly about anything. Now today in a hearing here at the West Feliciana Parish Courthouse, residents tried to force the Feliciana Sand and Gravel Company to show them how much money the company claims it's lost since the residents began to file their complaints. The judge is taking their request under advisement. Back to you, Andrea. Well, Marvin, what does the company say about all this? Well, the company claims it's doing nothing illegal or nothing wrong. Okay, Marvin, thank you very much.